Good afternoon. My name is Anne. How may I help you? Oh, you're looking to get your makeup done. Yes. Oh, you came to the right place, certainly. Oh, it's for a wedding. That's great. Your sister is asking me for you. Yes, certainly. Please take a seat. Um, I will do the best that I can to work with your image, as well as give you my best uh, expert advice, uh, and also especially and help you choose the best colors and um, based on your skin tone and tone. Does that sound good? Perfect. Well, to start, uh, let me take a look at you. Well, your skin does look quite beautiful. I'm just going to give you a little bit of a facial tip. Um, don't worry, it won't take longer than I usually expect it. Um, this is just a clinic, just a little bit to my top. Lovely cheekbone structure. Yes. Oh, you notice? <laughs> yes. I do have a bit of a, an accent because I lived in England with my husband for a while. Yes, now I'm back in the States. It was a difficult adjustment, yes. But I like it here. It's very lovely. <laughs> Thank you. Alright darling, so we are going to begin by um, applying foundation to your lovely skin. This is the best brand I have available. Um, it is by Givenchy and this is just a perfect match for your skin color. It's a pore skin. Um, it also has a bit of SPF and as I mentioned since it's going to be a bit of an early afternoon wedding, I think this is lovely for it. And uh, your skin will be protected as well. So, take it for one second. Just apply it as evenly as possible. On the forehead. To nest your eyebrows. <laughs> yes, some more on your cheek. Perfect. Done. Over and let's look down. Then. This will only take a few seconds. This is sort of a matte white. I'm going to put on your eyebrow to give them that pop, what they call the pop. Yes. Oh yes, now by the way you have a lovely, lovely looking color shadow to give to your eyes. Well, for eyeshadows I do have a couple of options for you and that just depends on whether you want to be um, sort of going with a particular theme or do you want me to just suggest the colors that I think would go best with your skin? Yes? The latter option would be good. Well, certainly. Um, I think that with your lovely green eyes, you could definitely benefit from a mixture of browns and grays. It does sound a little odd, but trust me, it looks beautiful in color. And this is the palette that I use for, you know, the green-eyed lady, if I could be green-eyed. Um, this particular color, uh, the brown, is a bit of a shimmer, but I think it would, would go great. Um, 
have as a base color, we are going to use um, this, which is a bit lighter and also a bit more nude, and um, would go great as a base. So we have that, and please feel free to suggest any alterations. Once you see the finished product, you will like it. Okay, so we will take it from there. Oh, this rainbow is coming out. I don't know why I did this to Jenny. Yeah. Oh no, no. Um, your schedule here is pretty flexible. Um, I've only worked afternoons ever since I got here and it has never been an issue. But thank you for asking. Um alright, so now to apply the dark color that I've been using. I think it's very light and you will see how your eyes will look. So I'm just gonna put that Oh, I've seen it before. Yes. Um, let me see. Alright, here's the mirror. Yeah. No, I did. It's very subtle, but at the same time, it makes you look quite beautiful. Uh, the blush will come toward the end, so I know you are probably very well versed at this. Um, I'm trying not to mess it up the best I can. Now I, this is just a suggestion. I don't think it's the shape of your eye that you necessarily need strong eyeliner. I, I, what I would suggest is actually some, um, some very toned um, eyelashes and that will help as natural as you want it. So that's all I'm gonna say. Yep. Great. So this is going to go this is actually one of my favorite mascaras. It actually goes um on the top and the bottom and it actually what it does is it lengthens. So you will see there's a Kind of separates each eyelash rather than clumping them together like most mascaras it just works to enhance the look and bring out that natural beauty i'm personally not very fond of really thick eyelashes in most cases they they do look quite thick and i believe that's their issue did you see how lovely that looks? Yeah. I'm glad you like it. Yeah. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go back and sort of pat your foundation, which I believe is very important for the last this line of lashes, especially here around the eye. Oh my god, I would kill to have this um, this eye structure that you have mine personally I always get dark circles and I don't know if you can sort of see they they pop out even though I put a lot of makeup on them and it just does not yeah um, all right well now I guess we're almost done here what time is the wedding is that okay Okay, well, we're about to finish up here, no problem, so let me just take some of the blush. Um, by the way, Smashbox has the best blushes, eyeshadows, the colors are beautiful, and uh, they're perfect for daytime wear and 
this is a mixture of blushes that I'm going to do. It has a, a bit of a lighter um, shade, darker one here. So what I do is I blend it all together. And based on your skin tone, which yours is very flexible to work with, it will contour your face quite, quite well. Yes, especially the cheekbones. You have to bring those out because they're absolutely beautiful. And down the nose, certainly. And the forehead, just a little bit. That looked lovely. Yeah. No, thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, yes, you may actually go to... Um, Monica at the counter, and she will give you suggestions uh, about jewelry that you might want to purchase. Yeah. Right. Is there anything else you would like this afternoon? Right, yes. Um, the final touches, I think, uh, are up to you. Um, I can give you a wide range of um, lip colors. Um, but ultimately, they are the ones that I think any of which would go very well with uh, your makeup. So feel free to choose any of the reds that I have here on the counter. Um, you, you can self-apply that. Um, I will give you a primer for the lips, which is always good uh, to keep them looking moist and healthy. And uh, I believe... Uh, that's it. We're done. Thank you so much for being here. Now I appreciate your time. Great, great. I look forward to seeing you. Bye-bye.